Sparky, you want to go? Sparky. Don't you want to go outside today? Huh? You don't want to go today? You don't want to hang out outside with the crickets in your pen? Maybe catch, catch a couple? Sparky, what's going on? Why don't you want to go outside today? Why not? Sparky. Sparky. Why don't you want to go outside? Huh? Why? Why are you just hanging out this morning? What's going on with you? Sparky. 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 Now that's more like it. You ready to go? Are you? You want to go? Gonna go. All right, then. Okay. We're going. Sparky. Did I raise the roof? Huh? Did I? I did, didn't I? This is what I did. There's Sparky's roof. I've got it attached to the hardware cloth. And Sparky was up on the log that's inside his high rise. And now he's looking out his high rise, aren't you, Sparky? Yeah, you are. Coming down his ramp. Sparky, I thought you would enjoy your high rise with the roof off of it today since it's kind of nippy. It's only around 70. We've got a wet substrate. I need to add some dry leaves. So I thought you'd enjoy it up there, but I guess not. I just found out Sparky's favorite rock is disintegrating and I went to clean it off and pieces fell off of the rock and this is his ba favorite basking rock and right here it's rough now it, it's like a river rock nice and smooth and nice and now it is chunky and I don't know, I know that um, rocks disintegrate over time, but I'm wondering if because I clean them off with vinegar water and then I rinse them, if that could accelerate the um, effects of the deterioration of the rocks. Now the other rock seems to be fine. They don't seem to be deteriorating. And over here, uh, I cleaned them off 
Uh, I just went ahead and cleaned them all off, um, even though Sparky only ate on this one paving stone this morning. I just went ahead and cleaned them off with vinegar water. Uh, I try to be very careful about anything that I use in Sparky's terrarium. Uh, so, like when I clean off uh, his terrarium uh, plexiglass, uh, which needs to be done now, I uh, use vinegar water on that on the glass so I'm just careful I don't use soap in his uh, is in his terrarium um, on occasion I probably have and then rinsed off the rock but I think that the vinegar is a better way to go because then there's no residue of uh, soap left uh, in the terrarium and Sparky wanted out today, so he's not in his terrarium. He is, uh, I've got him contained in, in the sunroom and in the bedroom. And most likely, he's under the bed. That is where he most likely is. And yes, that is where Sparky's at. I hear him. What are you up to, Spark? Hmm? What are you up to? I hear you. Yes, I do. I hear you. And there you are. It's dark in here, Sparky. I can barely see you. I can barely, barely see you. There you are. Do you know that we're going to get a lot more rain? You know, my hand's jiggly. This is a no-no for doing a video. Jiggly hand. You just want to play today, don't you? Yes, you do. I knew you'd want out today. He stayed in all day yesterday in his... Or no, you went out... Yeah, that's right, never mind. You went out yesterday, didn't you? You went outside. What was I thinking? Outside in your wet pen, you did pretty good. You didn't seem to mind it yesterday. But you want to play today, don't you? You want to roam the whole house. I know you do. Yes, you do. You want to roam the whole house, don't you? Hmm? You want to go outside? Do you? Well, let's go. Let's rumble. Um, I wanted to share with you uh, Sparky's new addition, um, to, new additions to his um, outside pen. He was sitting on his uh, Habahut log. This was wore out that I put out here. And so what I did was, um, it has been really, really rainy, and I made him a second deck uh, for his outside uh, area. Um, and so I sunk it down into the dirt because you don't want to have any sharp edges where they can... Uh, fall and gouge their eye or whatever. So uh, that's what I put in um, is, a, is a board there for his second deck. And he's got another deck that's hidden over on this side underneath uh, the uh, hostas. And he does use that a lot. So then uh, another thing that I did as I get in here And Sparky is going to write immediately chase down my shoes most likely if he doesn't I'm really surprised now he's going to go over and investigate what I did over here I want to sink it down flat with the soil because it has sharp edges so this is something where he can go on there and he can sharpen his beak if he wants to uh, or wear his beak down and I have seen him take his beak when he's outside and actually rub it across a brick, for instance. And so they know what they have to do. Uh, so um, that is the two additions for his outside pen. What do you think, Spark? Is that all right? Hmm? Is it okay?
Hey Sparky, LP got you three grubs. We'll bring them in to you, okay? There they are. Sparky will go nuts. See, you don't have to think about that one, do you, Sparky? One year I had a lot of grubs for them through the winter. Kept them in a five gallon bucket with leaves and dirt. And they did really well. I have a video on that. But they're hard to come by now. Sparky just has to relish them when he gets the opportunity. <laughs>